Deuteronomy 16, 17. Ish kematenat yado, keverkat Adonai Elohecha asher natan lach. So we've got a little bit shorter verse here today, but we start off here with man, as we might be a very common vocabulary word. But here, I think we have something like each man, or we might say every man. And the idea here is probably a distributive use of each, so that we get each here, each one. But we can put man in here also, because in verse 16, we uh, saw the word uh, zechor, who clarified we were talking about males here. So here we could say each man according to the gift of his hand, each man according to the gift of his hand. In other words, he shall not come empty-handed, but each man should come to these festivals, the place where the Lord chooses, according to the gift that is in his hand. Next, we get another prepositional phrase with the cough, according to, but notice the parallelism here. We might think about this. Now, this is not formally Hebrew poetry, but you do get a clarification of what is according to the gift of his hand is also according to the blessing of the Lord your God. Notice here we've got feminine singular construct again, so blessing of here, gift of of both of those feminine singular constructs. So according to the gift of his hand, according to the blessing, what he's bringing is what God has given to him. And that gets clarified with this relative clause down here, according to the blessing of the Lord his God, which he gave to you. Here we have a call perfect, third masculine singular of the root natan, you can see there. And the he of the verb is the Lord your God here, which the Lord your God, he has given to you.